we're gonna finish first and if i can't then you know people can blame me like they always do it's okay i i will take it on me um hey guys this is ashley kang of horizon esports and i'm joined by perks the mid laner of heretics hello hey after they defeat kc on the third day of week two of lec winter spirit uh winter season um hey perks um yeah there was a decent defeat uh there was a different success oh my god i almost spoke korean right there i'm really really sorry this is like 5 a.m and i'm so confused how are you right now <laughs> um i'm all right so we went to one both weeks and um uh... I would I would have preferred to go 3 zero, but you know uh, it's okay. We are most likely already locked for groups, which is already a step up from last split. So you know, taking it one step at a time. I am enjoying the progress. Yeah. I know that a lot of people were concerned about what Heretics will show in LEC after their very first game in week one, but it looks like it's been a positive. <laughs> Um, upwards trajectory ever since and I know that like the players have been on the broadcast saying that okay we were a bit of a slow starter but we seem to be on the track right now can you just tell me about how heretics have been building momentum in terms of performance in terms of moral um, in the last two weeks um I think it goes also from our streams they haven't been looking the best but I, I honestly didn't have one doubt because you know, I've had a lot of success with Wunder and Jankos in the past, and uh, I felt I felt really comfortable going on stages with them as well, right? You know, because we've been through everything, so it felt more natural for me as well. I think the first game was a bit of a fluke. Uh, it's always annoying to play first game unless you prepare something very cheesy, because we didn't expect some of their picks and maybe our prize were a bit off and also they then we take a fight level three and we are 1.3k down at three minutes and 30 seconds into game and we have no comeback mechanic so basically the whole game was just very hard and we i think the enemy team played also well and we didn't have like how like comeback but i would say both games against mad and g2 were kind of lost in draft and not to take away anything from enemies because i think they played really well but um, i'm looking forward to the revenge in playoffs basically you picked rise <laughs> uh, yeah With yeah it, it would be fine but yeah early game gone to south yeah how has the oh i know that so many people are curious about perks and wonder and yanko's rejoining and there is this whole feeling of nostalgia going back to 2019 2020 g2 but internally how has it been feeling like do you feel like you almost get the spark of synergy that you have felt in previous teams um i think we have to go over many less points than usual new teams have to go because we've worked together for so long and mm. i still think very highly of them that's why i joined as well right and um basically a lot of the basics that we've built over the years have also stayed and maybe some habits have stayed as well maybe some good ones some bad ones but we kind of it feels natural to play with them you know it feels like we've never really departed in a way and of course it's still about you know right now proving ourselves we've all had like a really poor last year and uh, uh, we haven't had results last year right so it's like of course it's normal for people to doubt us and think we could do poorly and it just started the year you know we might end up doing poorly anyways right if we somehow suck in the end but i have very high trust and hope in this team doing well and uh, i am uh, looking forward to what we can do more here i heard from other players that certain players see a game in specific way and then you just click in terms of how you see the game more with uh, well, player a compared to player b it doesn't mean that player a is better than player B that certain players seem to be more in frequency in terms of how they see the map, the tempo, how that game is supposed to be played out, what their win conditions are. Could it be similar to what you're describing? Um, yeah, I think we have a similar understanding for sure. I think we, we are uh, more or less on the same page 
at the beginning of our, of our scrims, we were not even reading the same book. And now we are starting to read the same page. Our uh, books were even in different languages. Yeah. One was Polish, one was Croatian. I think now we're all, all reading an English book and we all understand each other. Um, so yeah, I think there is a, still a lot more room for improvement and maybe cooking some drafts and preparing some some strategies that I think we can be better at than other teams. Uh, I think right now we're just playing the meta and playing what what is good in the meta. And I feel like we have a lot of, how do I say, secret strengths. I mean, secret strengths like picks that we are good at mm -hmm. that we will get the best out of each other, basically. Yeah, I think we can make each other shine on this team. If I ask any player in the LEC, what's your goal for this season? They'll probably say to win the whole thing. And I guess that has to be the goal of any professional player. But specifically, and also asking you to be, uh, like, if it is possible, um, where, where do you think Heretics will specifically finish in the winter season? And what are your reasonings behind it? Um, we're going to finish first. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And, and when people I hear their statement. First, yeah. yeah. And when people hear their statement, what are some of the specific reasons that they should believe in the statement? Hmm. Hmm. I mean, that's a good question, right? Really? Um, yeah, it's a good question, right? It's like, what can I tell somebody to make this believe? Like, they can either believe me or not believe me. Yeah. Um, like, I want to focus on myself and my own personal growth throughout the year and my own discipline and my own um, consistency. I want to be, I want to be the best performing Miller in the LEC, you know, I, wa I want to be consistent and I want to be strong and I want to be in people's faces. And I think as long as I can do that, I think we'll be first. Yeah. And if I can't, then, you know, people can blame me like they always do. It's okay. I, I will take it on me. That's esports, like always. Yeah. No problem. Yeah. <laughs> okay. First, I have to let you go because before Riot tells me off, I really appreciated the conversation. So hopefully I'll see you again at MSI, possibly Wells. Hopefully, yeah. That that is that is the goal. Yeah. Okay. I have to let you go. Bye bye. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. bye.